Hello everyone. Oh, uh, today I'm going to do my August favourites. Um, I hope you enjoy. And we're going to start with. Uh, this is a lip gloss from Avon. Actually all of my products from Avon. God I'm sad. Anyway. Um, this is a lip gloss. This is 24 karat lip gloss. Um, it's very pink. As you can see, very, very pink. But I don't know if you can see. Um, I can't really. It's very hard to tell. There's a lot. Oh, you can't smell it. There's a lot of um, of gold glitter going through it. Uh, now, uh, because it's so pink, you would think, oh my god, frightfully, frightful colour. But... It's very sheer, and I will show you uh, if I can. Uh, just do it again. Now, um, yeah, wrong hand, hand, but anyway, um, it's not as pink as it actually is, so it doesn't come out that bright pink, and you'll be thinking, "Oh my God, bright pink!" So yeah, I love this colour uh, just because it's so pink but it's actually not pink on your lips and the gold, uh, the gold glitter or flakes, whatever you want to call it, um, is nice. Kind of gives a little uh, three dimension to your lips, which is always good. Uh, the next thing I'm going to do or show you is the Eva Nail Expert Liquid Freeze. I love this stuff. Love it. Um, I smell in the cork. That's oh, it smells fruity. Um, uh, I can't can't remember what I described it in my uh, Avon collection, but it's it smells gorgeous. And the only thing, um, it's very oily after you spray it on your nails, and it's kind of you know uh, how this works is you left you put on your nails put on your nails you put on your nail polish uh, you leave it dry for about one to two minutes let it kind of be tacky and then you spray this on and it freezes it uh, it is it, it does work and it's good stuff and I love it especially if you're doing like um especially if you're doing uh, nail art and stuff and you have to wait like 20 minutes to half an hour before your nails are dry. You just spray this on. But then again, you still have, let if you have a lot of layers of nail polish, you do have to leave it on for quite a while. Not as long, but still a while. Um, but still a good, uh, good product by Evan. The next thing is the Advanced Technique Steely Shine Dry In Serum. Um, and it looks like this. And it smells like the matrix that you have uh, when you go to hairdressers and they wash your hair with the matrix shampoo. It's oh, and it leaves your hair so smooth and beautiful for the day, and then you have to go back to your old uh, crappy shampoo. <laughs> but uh, yeah, this is quite a good uh, product, and it smells gorgeous. I love the advanced techniques. The smell of the products are gorgeous. Uh, this is for all type, all hair types. Now my hair isn't really that dry, but I would put it on if I was straight in my hair. I would put it on. Let's say after having in the shower, I put it on. Let's say when my hair is half dry, I would put it on my ends so that when I'm straightening my hair, my hair like I know my hair will be. 100% dry but just the ends like the very ends it wouldn't be um it wouldn't damage it uh this isn't like a heat resistant or anything but it does it helps for the dry ends so i do like this product and i love the smell of it uh the next thing is uh solutions hydrating hyd Hydro Radiance, this is the day cream. I didn't get the night cream because I don't really put cream on my face during the night. I know you should, but I don't. Um, it just, it, the pillow, it just, I know you meant to like leave your uh, skin or the cream soak into your skin, but I think that um, it still leaves kind of smell on your pillow and 
I don't know, I just don't like it anyway. So I just got the, the Day Cream, and this has SPF 15 in it. Now, as you all know, I have dermatitis on my face and my hands lately, and uh, it was kind of annoying that you were trying to put it on for so long, and it wasn't kind of um, relieving anything, but uh, when my, my face isn't as dry as normal, um, usual days, I'd put it on, and it's a little pot like that with loads of cream in it. Mine is half gone because I use it every day when I use my um, uh, my other cream. I use this because there's SPF 15 in it, which is quite good. In fact, that today was such a beautiful day in Ireland. Woo -hoo! Uh, uh, the this cream came in handy. The fact that there's SPF 15 in it. Uh, my last but uh, least but last. Least but not last product is uh, the Advanced Techniques Daily Shine uh, Quick Touch Leave-In Conditioner, which this kind of goes with it because I, I actually got it in a pack. It was uh, shampoo, this, um, the uh, dry and serum, and it was um, a spray for your hair to make your hair make, uh, for your hair to be like really shiny, mirror shine. Um, something I don't actually have it with me at the moment, but uh, ju check out my oh hairs. Uh, check out my Avon collection, and I uh, that'll be in it. It's a pink little spray bottle like that, and it does make your hair uh shiny, especially if the sun is out. It does really make it good. Anyway, back to the leave-in conditioner. I wasn't too sure about this. Um, I don't really like leave-in conditioners and I thought, oh god, do you have to wash your hair the following morning? I know if you have really damaged hair, that's fair and good, you know, but I don't really have, my hair is quite good, in good condition. Uh, you know, I was thinking, god, the following day I'd be very oily and my, like, my pillow and i would be kind of smelly and oily and whatever, but... I did it once and I said, you know, I'll just have to give it a try, so I did, and you don't have to, like you can, you can wash your hair the following day, uh, but you don't have to because it doesn't leave any, uh, your hair, is, it feels really soft the following day, uh, it's like you didn't put any leave-in conditioner at all, it's absolutely fabulous, I love it, um, as I said, I've only used it uh, twice. I used it like a normal conditioner and it didn't work, obviously. Uh, but I thought it might. Um, but I left it on for a night and my hair was so silky smooth the following morning and I didn't have to wash out anything. Uh, of course, the following day you would have to wash your hair because your hair wouldn't, uh, wouldn't last the couple of days, especially my hair. I can't wash my hair. Uh, every single day because it would dry out the fact I have dermatitis and my scalp is very uh, dry as well. Um, so yeah, the following day my hair was quite nice. Um, as I said, it didn't seem like I had any leave-in conditioner in and um, I would recommend it to anybody who has damaged hair, um, who has dry ends maybe or whatever you know it does uh it does it does make your hair quite nice and it's a fabulous product fair play to avon um yeah that's it <laughs> i don't have any more um i hope you all enjoyed this and i'll see you all next time make sure to subscribe comment and like the video and i'll see you all next time bye